Um, so we're seeing more and more questions about how to make sure that your windows are insulated for the winter time and um, to cut down those electric costs. Um, so what do you think our customers can do to keep their houses at a more comfortable temperature? Well, we actually have a lot of great options that we offer uh, to insulate not only in the winter when it's cold outside, also in the summer when it's hot. The most popular option that we do have is going to be our cellular shades. Now, the honeycomb cells on those cellular shades are great. They act as a little pocket that traps that outside air to keep the hot air out or the cold air, and you won't feel it indoors as much. Those are available in single, double, and triple cell. That's right. So just to give you guys an idea of what those cells look like, I have a couple of examples here. So this one is the single cell, and the one that Michelle's got is the double cell. There you go. <laughs> we'll get zoomed in on this really quickly. And then the best option really is going to be this triple cell, but really anything is better than nothing. Um, but here you can see there are three pockets um, of those honeycomb cells. So they're all going to do a really great job trapping air. But like I said, anything is better than nothing. Um, they just really help to keep it down. And I love that they work in the winter or in the summer. So it's a really great investment for your house. And I hate paying the light bill, so I, <laughs> I don't, I don't mind making that investment. That's right, and then they are super customizable. You can get them in lots of different options, cordless corded. That's true. I mean, a million colors, yeah. like you name it. Really, it's you can make them exactly what you want. Exactly. Now, another great option, aside from our honeycomb shades, which are great, we also have our forward shutters. Now, our forward shutters actually come with a hollow louver, which acts kind of the same way as that honeycomb cell does by trapping that air and keeping it out of your home. That's right. And shutters add so much value to your home. They're a really classic look. You really can't go wrong. And just to give you an idea, this is like a sample size of a louver. Um, this is the part that you would tilt up and down in your shutter. And if you remove one of the pin ends, you can see it's actually hollow on the inside, and so that's where that air is going to get trapped in the forward shutter. It's kind of cool. That's right. Um, well, and another solution, actually, if you already have existing shades and you're not trying to invest in something else, you want to keep those that you have already in your home, you love them, you can always take a look at our draperies. Our draperies, you do have the option to add a thermal liner or a backing. That's right. Thermal liner is just a foam backing that's going to be on the street side of that drapery uh, that's facing the window. That's going to create a nice buffer between that window and the rest of your home. That's absolutely right. And I love the layering effect that um, yeah. draperies give those windows. Um, so those are really great tips to insulate your house. If you guys have other questions about them, please feel free to give us a call.